What's up everybody? It's Neil here with Gadget Hacks. In today's tutorial, we're going to be showing you how to delete apps off your Android device. But to be a little bit more precise, how to delete multiple apps. Whether you've noticed or not, as you use your device more and more, you've probably accumulated countless apps or games that you never play anymore. So, to help you out and to remove the clutter, I'm going to show you some easy ways, multiple ways, to remove multiple apps from your device at once. The first method isn't the most convenient or efficient, but it's doing it natively. On Samsung devices, there's a preference called Applications, and then there's Application Manager. On other devices, like Nexus devices, it's just Applications. So we're going to go into Application Manager. Now from here, you can sort the list through Downloaded, Running, all or disabled if you have any and I'm just gonna go to all now it's in alphabetical order now from here all you would do is look through the alphabetized list select an app then select uninstall alternatively you can go into the Google Play Store tap this little side panel go to my apps and you get a list of all the apps you've downloaded from Google Play now granted this may not have any third-party apps that you got off the Play Store but it will have a nice list you can then sort through and look through like we did with the app manager you can then just tap again and hit uninstall another method is using a file browser I'll be using ES file explorer but you can use the one that you like I just like this one personally now I'm just gonna tap this side menu keeping in mind that this is different for every app this is just ES go to the app page then from here you have to tap and then hold on one app to begin selecting multiple apps so this way you can select more than one and not have to go through the list like you did with the other method I previously showed you. You can then tap and then just hit the uninstall button right here at the bottom. Now keep in mind this confirmation right here that I have to hit uninstall again will pop up for every individual app I wanted to uninstall right now. If you're not interested in a file explorer, I'll suggest another third party application called easy uninstaller which makes it easy to uninstall multiple applications now there's similar apps to this one but I like this one just because of the fact that the interface is pretty up-to-date with material design and it's just easy to scroll through now all you do is open the application and just start checking the applications that you want to get rid of once you have the applications you want to get rid of hit uninstall down here at the bottom and again like the file explorer you'll need to tap uninstall for each individual application you're trying to uninstall. So we've been covering a lot of third-party applications but I'm sure you want to try to remove some of that bloatware or stock applications and while you may not be able to do so while unrooted you can hide them. Now this method I'll be showing you is exclusive to Galaxy or Samsung devices. For all other Android devices check out this guide over at GadgetHacks.com. So take a look at S Health. Going back to that app manager I chose S Health and all I'm going to do is select Disable. I can uninstall updates, whatever. Now it's disabled. If I go to the home screen, it's no longer there. If I go back to the App Manager and I go to the Disabled list, you should see S Health right there. And again, this won't uninstall it, but it'll keep it out of view and maybe it won't take up any more space in your app drawer. The last and final method we'll be covering is for rooted users. So if you're rooted, definitely pay attention. We'll be using ROM Toolbox, the light version, which is free. And all you have to do is launch the application and select App Manager. Now, there are two reasons why this is pretty damn awesome. The first being is that you can, well, let's select this option down here so we can select multiple apps first. The first being that you can delete stock applications uninstall them and the second being that when you hit the uninstall or the trash can right here all I need to do is confirm once and that's it I don't need to hit it multiple times once and it'll start uninstalling all of those applications I just checked if you want some more information or maybe some download links to the applications I use in this video check out the guide over at gadgethacks.com also don't forget to like comment and definitely hit subscribe if you want more awesome and very useful gadget hack videos. Thanks guys. Baby, I'm